to Virtual Reality Basin. I hope you're doing really well. It's been a while since my last review. I thought I'd check out the AMVR power bank fixing bracket. Really, really easy to, to fix to your Quest guys. Uh, I'll just show you what it looks like on the Quest. As you can see there, you've got uh, the power connector cable there, which the bracket pack comes with. That's it on the back of the Quest. Fits in really, really easy. It basically hooks onto your straps. And as you can see, you can still have the padding around your Quest, which is a bonus. The power bank itself doesn't come with it. This is something I had separately. If you want to know what power bank I use, hit me up on the comments below and I'll let you know, no problem. All right guys, so I'm just going to show you how we can fix this bracket really easy onto the Quest. It's a little bit fiddly, but it's, it's not hard. Uh, please ignore the white markings on my straps. There's nothing wrong with it, it's not worn away. That's just due to the padding that sits on it, but it makes a big difference. Right, so we're gonna take me a minute or so probably just to fit it. Uh, you've gotta make sure it's lined up correctly, I believe that is. And so you slot one end in, and then you need to sort of bend that in there. So there you go, that's one end in. That didn't take too long at all, did it? Uh, not sure how well you can see that on the, on the uh, video itself, but yeah, it's not hard. We'll move this along a little bit, and I've clipped in one end on the other side, bend it in, boom, done. So you get these two straps as well included. Now what I do here is I'm going to grab my main battery that I've got, my power bank, and just feed, oh, you need to make sure it's the right way, so that's going to be, yeah that'd be the right way. So you feed that through there. Remember it's not fixed in yet guys, so we'll slide around a little bit. Thank you. Strap it down, strap it down. It's fixed in place. Probably adjust that so it's a little bit more even. So there we go. One done, and you do basically you just do the same again, obviously. So we'll feed that through, and then you feed that through the top end. Secure it, secure it. So that's pretty much secured. It's a bit uneven there, but I'll sort that out in a moment. Uh, the cable, you grab your cable. It comes with a detachable this, so this can stay in your Quest if you want it to. Obviously, unless you're using uh, your Quest for a rift, you know, with a link cable or something like that. But otherwise, it'll stay on there. It's magnetic as well, so there you go. Then I'm going to plug in my battery. Yeah, and it even lights up there, so you know it's it's working. I mean. Depending on what battery you get as well, you might get some lights on it as well. Again, if you want to know what battery this, this that I'm using, just let me know in the comments and I'll let you know the Amazon link. Okay, so that's with the the uh, foam padding added back on. I didn't think you'd want to watch me just add that on. It's not what this, this video is about. Obviously, there'll be a link below if you want to, if you're interested in, in getting this bracket for your Quest. I have tested it out, obviously, and actually used it, of course. It feels quite comfortable, you, you, you can't feel that on there, and depending on the size of the battery, it might act as a bit of a counterweight, but I find the padding really helps, to be honest, with the problems with the Quest. Comfort, that is. If you like this video, guys, you know, give me a like, I'd really, really appreciate it. And if you want to see my future streams, videos, etc., then make sure you hit that subscribe button, guys, and the bell notification. Okay, have a great day.